Gavin Newsom. Gavin Newsom is going to be swamped at the last minute to replace Joe Biden, who is gone. Joe Biden, who is gone. Kamala Harris will be replaced as well. Believe it or not, Even Money shows uh, Gretchen Whitmer. I have been saying this for over two years. And it's not just me thinking this. It's not just me saying, oh, I think this would be kind of interesting. It's not because I like him. I think he's competent. No, 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 no. This has been inside intel. Deep intel. Kind of dark web. Behind the scenes. Really inside stuff. Watching media buys. Listening to big donors. Since the beginning of time. Since you can imagine. You can't ask yourself why. You can't worry yourself with, but isn't he a bad person? No, 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 no. It, it doesn't matter what you think. It doesn't matter what I think. It doesn't matter the current state of California. None of it None of it matters. Whether you like it or not, whether it makes sense or not, they don't care what you think. They pick this jadrool, this very sick and ill man. Gavin Newsom is... is Elvis compared to this idiot. Any, any Emmanuel Lewis, TV's Webster, is a dreamboat compared to this guy. And and you think that Gavin Newsom is worse than this man who's not here? Who's walking off talking to nobody? Who appears to be relieving himself in mid-squat? Though I don't think that happened, but it looked like it, didn't it? Didn't it? In any event, all excretory humor aside, Gavin Newsom plays the perfect foil, the replacement. Young, tall, tailored clothes, got the look, smoother. Believe me, Professor Irwin Corey would be smoother and more glib and more lucid than Joe Biden. It's really not saying a lot, but either way, what I'm telling you is that you must understand and drastically focus upon and understand what we are talking about here. This is something that goes beyond anything that anybody even ever could imagine. Now, again, you're, I, I, I know what you're thinking, but why? But why? I don't know why. Why would you pick Kamala Harris in the first place? I don't know. Because she's black and she's a woman. That doesn't matter. Do you know how many black Women who are smart and talented and don't have this weird hebephrenic, weird psycho cackle, cacination, pseudobulbar, affect, schizoid laugh like this dingbat? Are you kidding me? I don't know why. I don't know why they take him out. And this talk about, he's not going to make any kind of a, of a, of a debate. There isn't enough Adderall on the planet for this. You could, you could, you could fix it so that Trump can't say anything. You could fix the rules for the debate so that Trump cannot respond or say anything, and Trump would still win the debate. And by the way, these aren't debates; we always call them. You've been gaslighted by him from the beginning, and they have no respect for you. I'm telling you. They hate you. And if you're a Democrat, they really hate you. You see, Democrats really don't care for Biden. They have their big thing seems to be things like, oh, I know they'll talk about climate change a little bit. Abortion's a big one. Oh, my God. They love abortion. It's just, and, and they, they've got it in their mind that somehow abortion has been banned. It's not banned. It's not at all. But, but that's what they care about. The Democratic Party has been taken over by this virus called the shadow government. You can call it the deep state, police state, intel state, ruling class, whatever you want to call it. They're running the show. And Gavin Newsom is going to come in and he knows exactly the script. He knows exactly what to say. And anything that they tell him, he'll blame either Trump somehow or old policies. But remember, the switch is coming. It's going to come so fast, it'll make your head spin. And they'll act like there's nothing to watch, nothing to see here. What are you talking about? More, as I hate to use this overused term, more gaslighting.